Location at Ipswich River Park in Reading, Massachusetts, where today the Boston Demons Reserve Squad will face the Quebec Saints. Hello and welcome to another edition of Stateside Footy. I'm Bill Robert alongside Cal Serino, ready to bring you the action of today's Australian Rules football match. Stateside Footy is brought to you by the volunteers of WCTV, Wilmington Community Television. Well, this time out, the name of the game is Metro Footy. Metro Footy, in case you're not aware, is an offshoot of Australian Rules football, adapted for situations in which there may not be enough people or field space available for a full-fledged footy match, and that's really what we have here today, where uh, the Quebec Saints came down with uh, eight players and actually uh, borrowed a couple from the Demons today, Kyle. Including the president. That's right. The club president, uh, Mike Shepard, will actually be playing uh, for the uh, Quebec Saints today. The, he's the club president of the Boston Demons. In addition, another member of the Demons, who actually used to be a Saint, is uh, going to be on the field for the uh, Saints as well today, and uh, that is uh, number, uh, where was he here, number 21, P.J. Devine. Mm -hmm. We'll see if it's a good fit again. Indeed. Now, in addition to the teams being smaller and the field being a little smaller, uh, the quarters are also smaller as well. Uh, normally, you have uh, 20 minutes, and it's kept like soccer where you actually add time for stoppage mm -hmm. time or pe penalty time or injury time or whatever. In this case, they're going running time. Basically, each quarter is 15 minutes long. The mm -hmm. clock's just going to be running through the whole thing, and that's uh, pretty much it. Now, Metro Footy is actually it's, it's mostly, from what I understand, an American creation. Uh, a lot of uh, teams starting up. In fact, there are four teams in the Boston area. Uh, the players of the Demons there's the full Demons roster, but also those players, actually, the, the, the Demons can be broken up, and they actually have four Metro teams as well in the area. Um, and it's a real fun event where they have every year, they just did it a couple of weeks ago, a uh, tournament for what they call the Chowder Cup. And the uh, tournament was uh, won uh, was the, about a week and a half to two weeks ago from the time uh, we recorded this, and it was won by the Cambridge Lobstermen, who uh, edged out the Watertown Rats by an 11-point victory. The Saints come down from the province of Quebec today to face the Heat and the Demons on this Saturday afternoon in Reading. We'll have the action for you coming up next. It's Stateside Footy, and it's coming up next, brought to you by the volunteers of WCTV, Wilmington Community Television. One day, you were simply struggling to be a dad. The next, you're coping with a diagnosis of childhood cancer. CureSearch.org can help. It's run by doctors and scientists whose research has led to an overall cure rate of 78%. You're not as alone as you feel. And now, we here at Stateside Footy present a viewer's guide to Australian rules football, or as it's quite commonly called, footy. Actually, today's game is Metro Footy, which is a mostly American offshoot of Australian rules, adapted to fit situations in which only smaller teams and or fields are available. Australian rules football is one of the most popular sports in Australia. It's a blend of speed, precision, and physical contact, and is often a rough, tough, high-scoring affair. The game is played using an oblong ball, similar to the ball used in American or Canadian football, but with rounder, less pointy ends. The ball is also nicknamed the footy. A typical game of Metro footy consists of four 15-minute quarters. A Metro footy field, or ground as it is called, can be rectangular or oval-shaped, usually 110 meters long by 50 meters wide. There are only a few markings on the field. There's the center square, in which the opening contests for possession take place. The center square is flanked by two long arcs known as the 50-meter lines. They're there to indicate the distance from the goal. That's their only function. Then there are the goal squares, which extend out from between the goal posts at each end. At both ends of the field, there's a set of four posts. The object of the game is to amass the highest score by kicking the ball through these posts. The two inner posts are called the goal posts. If you kick the ball through the goal posts, that is a goal, and your team gets six points. The ball can either travel through the air or along the ground. 
as long as it goes between the goalposts without making contact with other players or the goalposts themselves. The outer posts are called the behind posts. Any ball kicked between one of the behind posts and one of the goalposts is called a behind and is worth one point. A behind will also be awarded if the kicked ball hits one of the goalposts or if it's touched by another player before it goes through the goalposts. In either case, one point is awarded. Scores in Australian football are given in three parts, similar to a box score in baseball, except instead of runs, hits, and errors, you'll see goals, behinds, and total points. When you see a score listed in this way, for instance, 12, 7, 79, it means a team scored 12 six-point goals and seven one-point behinds for a total score of 79 points. Each team consists of 22 players, 18 of which are on the field at any time. The four remaining players sit on the interchange bench and change out back and forth with the players on the field as needed. The game starts with an opening ball up or ruck. It's a basic contest for possession of the ball, and it's just like the opening tip-off at a basketball game. The umpire either throws the ball up or bounces it off the ground, and both sides jump for control of it. A ball up takes place at the start of each quarter, after a goal has been kicked, and if the ball is in a pile of tackled players on the ground. The ball is also thrown up for grabs from the boundary line anytime the ball rolls, bounces, or is carried out of bounds. Once a player has possession of the ball, he can do three things with it. The player can run with it. You're allowed to carry and run with the ball, but the ball must be bounced off the ground every 15 meters as this is going on. The player can hand pass it to a teammate. In footy, throwing the ball to a teammate is not allowed. These hand passes, called handballs, are executed by holding the ball in one hand and punching it out of the hand with the closed fist of the other hand, just like an underhanded volleyball serve. Or the player can kick the ball to a teammate. If the ball travels more than 15 meters and is caught on the fly, that is called a mark. The umpire will blow the whistle to signal the mark and award the player who caught the ball a free kick from the spot where the ball was caught. The player can either stop and use the free kick or play on to continue to advance the ball up the field if his team is in an advantageous situation. There are two types of marks, an uncontested mark in which the player is by himself when he catches the ball or a contested mark where a number of players are all going for the ball at the same time. If a player on the opposing team catches the ball on the fly, then he is awarded or paid the mark and given the option to use a free kick or play on and move the ball. In addition to marks, free kicks are also paid if a player is running with the ball and gets tackled without properly disposing of the ball. This is called holding the ball and will get the opposition a free kick. If a player is pushed down with a hand or hands to the back, a push on the back violation will be assessed to the guilty party and the player who was pushed gets the free kick. If a player kicks a ball out of bounds on the fly, the ball is considered to have gone out on the full and the opposing team gets the free kick. Or if a team has scored a behind. After the behind has been scored, the opposing team gets a free kick from the back goal square. Though the players on the field have assigned positions, the game is free-flowing and players will wind up going back and forth up and down the entire field continuously. At the end of the game, or full time, the team with the most points is the winner. If the score is tied or level at full time, then the game ends in a draw. One quick note, a lot of people will see the game being played and assume it's rugby. Australian rules football is not rugby. Though there are similarities, namely in the balls used in the respective games, the dominance of rugby in some parts of Australia, and some of the physical contests for ball possession along the ground, there are major differences between the two games, such as footy is played on an oval-shaped field, while both codes of rugby are played on a rectangular gridiron-style field like those used in American and Canadian football. In rugby, the ultimate goal is to carry the ball over the goal line. In footy, the ultimate goal is to kick it over the goal line. In rugby, you can throw the ball to a teammate, but you can't pass the ball forward. In footy, you can pass the ball forward, you just can't throw it. And that's a quick guide to Australian rules football. There's more to the game, including the awarding of 50 meter penalties and the like, but this quick clip should be enough to get you on your way to watching and hopefully following along with an Australian rules football match. Thanks for watching and get ready next for Stateside Footy. Aren't you gonna kiss me? I gotta go. Nobody likes to kiss an ashtray. <laughs> Getting set for it here now. They're about to put it up.
And? And the opening throw. Here we oh. go. And we started the first period of play. And coming out, let's see who uh, is able to clear it out of center. Looks like Quebec's going to get the clearance out of the ruck. And uh, kick down now. They've got a lead there. Down there is number 35, Daniel Barker. However, it's taken. Uh, D's are going to come back with it now, kicking it there. That's uh, 20, uh, 23, Quebec I think. That's uh, Ward. Mm -hmm. However, Quebec's got it now. The free right kick there. Center, yeah. He's going to try and get it uh, towards the middle. It's picked off. Nice uh, nice mark there. However, he played on, All it looked like. surrounded, yeah. Yeah, he's... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and the fridge gets taken to ground. And uh, let's see. Uh, looks like they're going to ball it up right there. All right. Let's see who can get their hands on it this time. If anyone. Actually, no, Quebec does get a free kick. Oh, and let's that? see. It went through. Let's see what the call is. That's a goal. All right. Quebec gets the first goal of the game. That's, and momentum's huge. I mean, obviously, you know, they've got a few people from Boston, so a few players on loan. So this is good to you know, get everyone marching in the same direction. Well, one of the players on loan, funny you should mention that, P.J. Devine actually was a member of the Quebec Saints at one point, but he moved to Boston. And now is uh, part of the Demons. So so that was a goal for the uh, Saints. So the Saints are up now uh, by a score of 6 to nothing over the Demons. And once again, here comes the center throw in. And once again, looks like the Saints are going to get the clearance. No, Demons have it now. They're trying to move with it. Ball still loose. And, and they're going to ball it up. Okay. Looks like, or will they pay a free kick? Let's see. No, they're going to ball it up. Mm -hmm. Last time it was on the ground, they, uh, they actually wound up paying a free kick to Quebec, which is how they got the goal scored. So once again, out of that ruck, trying to move through. Now here come uh, the Demons momentarily. There and uh, Good kick, kick going down inside 50. They can't get oh, it though. Not quite there. Quebec coming out with it there, trying to kick it there. It's number 21, PJ Devine, who we just mentioned. Goes back. Kick goes uh, through the middle of the field. Now it's just going to no, roll, and uh, they can't get it off the ground. And Nobody it's still loose ball. Kick there, and he's uh, kicking it towards goal, and it oh. goes through. That's. Another six for Quebec. That puts him 12 up on Boston. Yeah. Um, Got to see who that was. Got to get the number. Mm -hmm. um, was that Devine that put that one through? Uh, no, actually 18. Let's see. That's Mick Lacey. Mick Lacey gets the goal for the Saints. Now the Saints are up uh, two goals nil. And we'll have another uh, throw in at center. Even the rest are having a good game. Yeah. Nice mark by the, uh, the umpire there. But uh, 220 into this game, and already Quebec is up by two goals. They're looking to go up by three here is uh, once again they get the clearance out of the ruck and it's kicked and it's going to dribble. Let's see how it oh. goes. It's going That's through. A third. That's a quick goal there. All kinds of speed. That's what you need. Yep. It's got to get the number. One of the uh, female members of the team here. It's just uh, got to turn this way so we can see a number. Um. A little bit. <laughs> <laughs> We've actually got uh, two, and I believe they're sisters, Amy Legault and also Margot Legault. Hmm. So uh, it's one of them. Question is which one is it? Let's see. Can we see her number yet? I think. Uh, I think it's Margo, 40, mm -hmm. 41. So, or is it, no? No, I'm sorry, it's 10. It's Amy. Amy will go with that nice goal there right out of center. And now, Quebec trying to make a move with it again, handball into the center. And uh, battle for it now. Trying to get it there for the Demons was uh, Mark Sleet. And once again, uh, they try and kick it inside 50. Quebec does. And it's kicked out there. Nice mark there. That came right to him. Mike Shepard takes the mark. He's actually one of the Demons members. <laughs> it's on loan. Yeah. And, uh, oh, nice mark right in front. Right in front of goal. Didn't have to lay, lay all the way off of that one, but he definitely got that one in uh, good hands. He's, he's got the mark, which means it's a free kick. It's a Darren Haverhoek now uh, trying to go uh, four goals up now for the uh, Saints. No. Let's see. Too much elevation. Can't get his hands on it. That's a goal. So that's, uh, that's four goals already, yeah. and so far, uh, the ball has bounced inside the uh, Boston 50 once. Other than that, this game's been all Quebec so far. Not not really the, you know, the start they want, but I mean, you know, like we said, it really hasn't been that much time. Mm -hmm. So right. No, actually, we're four minutes into the quarter now. Mm -hmm. So they just need. Uh, sometimes all a team needs is that one good break. Hopefully, they can get it off this. And uh, the demons trying to uh, move it out of the ruck now. A little battle for their center. Quebec getting their hands on it now, and the hand pass comes out, and uh, they try and kick it forward. And let's see, uh, it's going to stay in bounds, and uh, they try and kick it uh, towards the goal square. However, let's see, uh, one of the, Legault has it there, and let's see. No, nope. it's going to be a behind. Okay. So that's going to be uh, another point there. So now we've got uh, four goals, one for the Saints. So far, nothing for the. Uh, Demons. Barely stopped recapping the last <laughs> one before they got yeah. it in. Uh, missed with it, though. It's a behind. 
Uh, so once again, what happened the last time is, obviously uh, when you have a goal, it comes back to center. When it's a behind, the opposing team gets to kick it out from the goal square. But uh, the, the, the kick from the goal square wound up going right to a Quebec player. And they moved it right back in, but they missed with the kick. So now it's uh, four goals, two behinds for Quebec. And once again, uh, kicking it out right now. Can't mark it. Can't hold the mark there. We've got a loose ball in the middle of the field. Trying to get it there. Kyle Graham can't do it. It's kicked back now. Quebec trying to kick it inside 50. It's a little too high, though. Will they get it before it goes out? And it looks like it's just going to go out. They're going to have a boundary throw in. Okay. Yeah, they need, they need to stop them here because if they just keep rolling like this, you know, yeah. there's only so much ground you can make up. This is true. This is true. Yeah. It is early in the game, however. And the throw in comes in. Uh, and it's uh, punched out. Uh, looks like it's out of bounds again. Mm -hmm. It was uh, punched out there by uh, number 31 for the Demons, Sean Burbank. And another boundary throw in now on the Quebec side of the field. Coming in again and uh, winds up in Quebec hands. Is that going out? Um, did it bounce out or did it go out on the full? Uh, looks oh, like it bounced out. Yeah. It's a bounce, so it's mm -hmm. a boundary throw in as opposed to a free kick paid to the uh, Boston Demons. Another one goes up. Coming up again, and let's see here. And a tip. Back walks and it's a again. kick for goal. Let's and see the call. Let's see what we've got here. That's a behind as well. The kick by number 35, Daniel Barker. So now it's uh, four goals, three for the uh, Quebec Saints. And the ball has really yet to touch the Boston part of the field. Mm. Let's Hopefully they can keep it in Boston hands with this kick. Once again, the mm -hmm. kick out. Trying to go for the mark there. Uh. And it is the mark. It's uh, paid to uh, Darren Haverhoek, number 43. Yeah, there's... And he's going to kick it uh, right inside. And Was that behind her? No, it looks like... Uh, I actually think it went, uh, mm -hmm. didn't go anywhere. It's uh, going to be out on the full. So um, the Boston Demons are going to get the free kick. Get another shot at getting it out. Yep. Okay. And moving it up the field. So he's actually just going to take it himself and then uh, play on, move up the field. Tries to get it up and uh, handball there. Blue shirts everywhere. It's, yes. it's not. Yeah. And the kick to trying to get it back inside 50. And uh, just a little over. And it's going to go for a behind. It's going to be touched there, and uh, now it's uh, four goals, four for the Saints. Four goals, four, which means uh, 28 points for the Saints. So far, the Demons being shut out. Like you said, really not that much time's passed. We're still, yep. mm, this could just be a hot streak, but yeah. Man. We're halfway through the first quarter now. And once again, a free kick going to the Saints. Haverhoek once again with it. Going up. And he makes a kick. Good kick is high. Looks good. And it looks like it went through. We just have to wait for the goal umpire. That's a goal. Mm -hmm. He had plenty on that one. He could have gotten. He could have been much further out and still had that. Absolutely. So now we're at uh, five goals, four for the Saints. And they get it uh, set uh, back uh, to the uh, middle part of the field. And uh, the Demons looking to uh, try and get some clearances working their way, move it uh, into their forward 50. Yeah, there's no, no real chances for them to show off what they've got offensively. There's right. Only Quebec shooting right through him. And once again, Quebec with it, but uh, the kick uh, gets smothered there. It goes off a body. Quebec moving it now, though. Handball uh, attempt going through. Someone tried to someone tried to kick it there, and it's going to go right through. That's another goal. So it's six goals, four now for the Saints. Six in the first half. That's not, not really yeah. what Boston wants to see. Yeah, six goals, four. So that's 40 now for the Saints. And they'll bring it back to the mid part of the field. Mm -hmm. Not a great start, but a nice day to have it on. Yeah, back to the center square we go now. Although it's hard to say center square because everything's marked out in traffic cones, but yeah. uh, I guess we can say center square for the purpose of sounding authentic. And once again, looks like uh, Quebec will be the first one there. Haverhoek, it looks like, he's got it. He's going to make a kick for goal. And it looks like this one's going to go wide. Oh, we got yep, a behind with That's that a behind there. So now it's uh, six goals, five for the Saints. We're here at Ipswich River Park, stateside footy. We're watching Metro footy right now. The Boston Demons going up against the Quebec Saints, and so far the game has been all Quebec. A field day, frankly. They're just running yeah. wild right through them. Well, actually a ground day. How about that? And nice mark there. I was going to say All Saints Day, but that's just yeah. corny. <laughs> I think they said that a few weeks ago when St. Kilda beat Geelong. Let's see here. Uh, 
Boston finally getting some offense. Oh. Right, but uh, <laughs> Quebec getting in there as well. Curse of the commentator on that and one a little looks, bit. Uh, and uh, the free kick is going to be paid to the Saints. And uh, they're just going to try and move it along. And uh, trying to go in for the mark there was uh, number 30 for the Saints. That was Dave Morton, who's coming in off the uh, off the interchange bench. A for effort, though. Yeah. Uh, Daniel Barker tried to get it there. And let's see. Uh, looks like we have a free kick paid to the Demons on that one. Mm -hmm. So the free kick taken by Joe Connor. Looks like he got smothered, though. And now with it is Amy Legault, who's got a goal. And once again, here they Perfect come with bounce it. for him, man. Yeah, game, get, get him right in stride. And it's a goal. So what's that now? Seven, seven goals, goals, five. five behind. Seven, seven goals, five, as our stuff gets blown all over mm -hmm. the place here. But, hey, it's a warm day. Mm -hmm. It's a hot, humid day, so it's a breeze, so we're digging that. Mm -hmm. At some point, we'll have, we'll have to have one of the cameras pan around for the look at our uh, mobile press box here. <laughs> a tent and a table, and it's working. It's we travel beautiful. in style. We travel in style. <laughs> Absolutely. Here they go up again. Once again, uh, from uh, center there. Whoa. Let's see here. Battle Forge still on the ground. Uh, Demon's trying to kick it away. Can't do it. Quebec comes with it again, and the kick. They try and get it inside 50, and uh, can't quite take the mm -hmm. mark, although they looks like they'll be paying in the free kick, though. And Barker makes a kick toward goal. Looks like he uh, missed. Looks like a uh, behind. Yep, it's going to be a behind. Breeze really isn't cooperating with Boston. <laughs> if it picks up, they'll start, you know, getting some, a few less goals, a few more behinds. They could yeah, use that. Yeah, at this point, are we looking at uh, All Saints Day or the Boston Massacre? Let's see if they can keep this one in friendly hands. Yeah. Let's see, and the kick goes out now. And can't take the mark there. That was uh, number 31, Sean Burbank. He's battling now, and uh, mm -hmm. let's see uh, what they're going to do here. I think they're going to pay the... Uh, uh, no, actually, it's going to be a boundary throw-in. Just rolled out. We weren't kidding about being a hot day. Yeah. Oh, yeah, exactly. <laughs> there we go. Even the umpires are going shirtless now. And it uh, goes over. This kick uh, goes off a body, smothered a little bit there. And now a battle for it uh, just around, just outside, uh, just around the 50-meter line, actually. And Boston it's coming up now. And... Um, Trying to soccer it ahead almost there was Andrew Burns, but now mm -hmm. uh, they kick it back. Took oh, it right what a mark taken right in front of goal. That's Shepard. One of the demons who's actually on the winning side. <laughs> Michael Shepard is actually the president of the Boston Demons Football Club. But uh, since Quebec only came down with uh, eight players, uh, Boston lent them a few. Mike Shepard being one of them, and he's actually got a free kick for goal. And they'll be glad to have him. And <laughs> moves like that. Who yeah. can argue with it? And Shepard with the kick. And it looks like he nailed it. Indeed he did. There's mm -hmm. a signal for the goal. That makes eight goals on the day. Eight goals, six now for the Saints. And the Demons still looking to get some traction. <laughs> Heading up one more time. In the forward end of the field. Gets a hand on it. We'll have to edit that out. Kick goes and coming down with it, uh, nobody. Mm -hmm. However, right between uh, the two of them, but moving ahead now for the Saints, that was Luke Anderson. It's up in the air. Oh, nice right mark the numbers, right there. Yeah. And he goes through with it. Yep. Oh, that's a behind. Offline a little bit there with that kick. Still had good power on it, though. Yep. 8-7. With, with any luck... Quebec will be run, will be out of steam by the second quarter. <laughs> I don't know. Do they have a mercy rule in footy? <laughs> We're going to find out if they keep up at this rate. Yeah. Let's see here. Uh, Battle for it's going. Uh, it's still on the ground right now. And uh, the Demons are coming out with it. Uh, quick handball there. And the kick ahead looking for uh, someone, anybody there. <laughs> that and, cameraman uh, almost had a good getting chance Getting there first. It. looks like it's going to be Luke Anderson for the Saints. And he gets it uh, to uh, Amy Legault. Kicked it up, Ooh. and uh, Mark taken there. Nice job once again by Darren Haverhoek. Let's see where he's going to make the to connection. Kick, um, he can try it. Uh, a little long to kick for goal, but let's see what he does here. He certainly he's got, got a couple of players in uh, right, right in the right in the goal square. He's going to go for it. He's going to go for it, and looks like he nailed it. Maybe not that far after all. No, he got it absolutely. That's another goal for the Saints. 
So that's 9-7 now. Nine goals, seven for the Saints. And uh, all things nil for the uh, Boston Demons. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for someone who didn't, oh, that's time. Yep, that's uh, that's time. That's quarter time here at the Ipswich River Park facility. And after one quarter, the score stands. The Quebec Saints, nine goals, seven. The Boston Demons, nothing. We'll be back with second quarter action next. You're watching Stateside Footy right here on WCTV, Wilmington Community Television. May I have your attention, please, with the owner of the spare tire, <laughs> slightly hairy, uh, with a little brown mold to the left of the belly button. It's an any. Please report to the press box and retrieve your appendage. Oh, they must have lost this parking further away from the stadium and walking in. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're back to the action. We're at quarter time here at Ipswich River Park, and the score stands. The Quebec Saints, 9-7-61, and the Boston Demons, nothing, nothing, nothing. Yeah, Quebec may not have brought a full team, but they definitely brought their A game. Mm -hmm, absolutely, and uh, once again, keep in mind, too, that uh, a lot of the players you're seeing out here in the uh, Demons colors are the reserve players. Mm -hmm. uh, they uh, are playing. Uh, a couple of the players, uh, obviously, too, uh, made the... Uh, Transition from the demon side to the Saints side, them being a club president Mike Shepard and PJ Devine, who actually used to be a member of the Quebec Saints. <laughs> it's a good fit. Yeah, <laughs> well, it is right now. Actually, Shepard's the one kicking goals for them. Mm -hmm. yep. Here we go. We've got it now. They're going to throw up the ball, and second quarter is underway. Wow. And uh, now the demons uh, with the clearance there, and they handball it ahead. However, winds up in Quebec hands. Poor connection. Yeah. And then whoop. And it looks like there'll be a free kick paid to the uh, Demons there. I believe that uh, was a holding the ball infraction on Quebec. So getting the free kick is going to be uh, Joe Connor, number 38, for the Demons. Let's see where he goes with it. Puts it up. And he kicks it up. I don't know if it's got the distance, but it's no. going to be pretty close. And it's... Uh... No, it wasn't a behind. That's wasn't it behind? No, it went out. Uh, the question is... Did it reach the boundary line before it went out? Uh, do we have a boundary throw? Uh, no, mm -hmm. okay. We have a boundary throw in. It didn't Let's go out it. on the full. So. Let's hope it didn't get under it. And they try and uh, punch it ahead. And uh, the first one there, it looks like uh, that's going to be uh, divine. And uh, looks like it's going out again. Mm -hmm. This time the demons are getting the free kick. Tough angle for goal, but let's see what they do here. Mm hmm Still an opportunity to try and kick it right in front. Connection. We've got someone uh, camped out right there, went over his head. That was uh, Matt Garofalo. And that's going to go out, and it looks like we'll have another boundary throw in. Mm -hmm. As they make sure the uh, goal posts are straight and true. Oh, and right into his hands. Right into his hands, yep. And the kick uh, smothered a bit. Smothered a bit. And oh, nice mark, been... though. Right there was Sean Burbank. And he's going to have a kick for goal now. Good vertical on that one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, oh, hang on. A little bit of hesitation. <laughs> <laughs> I think someone's messing with his head. And he puts it in, makes a kick. There we go. And let's see. Oh, missed it. But hey, they, they're definitely getting definitely getting a little bit tighter. I know sometimes with game no, you, where you can't stop, you don't have that second where everyone can put their heads right. together. Yeah, by the way, at our vantage point from here, we're kind of at a tough angle to see definitively. Marks and um, goals and behinds a lot of times, so that's why we wait for the goal umpire's signal before we indicate. Let's see here. Battle for it on the ground now. And free kick, uh, let's see, will be paid to nobody. They're going to ball it up. Up it goes. Who's going to get it there first? Demons, one of their main problems has been in the ruck trying to get clearances, and they can't. And uh, with it now, Quebec trying to move it forward, trying to get it uh, out of their back 50. Oh. And it's a loose ball now. And it's kicked out there. Tried to get it to Amy Legault, can't do it. And uh, kick a little too high and shallow. No one there for it either. And it looks like it's just going to go out. We're going to get a boundary throw in. Good outcome for the Demons, mm -hmm. though. Looked like they had uh, a Saint under it that might have been able to make the mark on that, but... Uh, 
This way, still the demons will still have a get a sh have a shot to get it within their forward 50, mm -hmm. and stay on uh, offense. Punch back, and the kick goes through, and it uh, looks like we got another behind, and indeed we do. The important thing is the demons are on the board now. They've got two behind, so they are on the scoreboard now. It's uh, 61 to two the score. And hopefully they can get under this kick too. I mean, like we said before, mm -hmm. momentum. Yeah. A lot of the kicks we've seen from the Demons so far seem to be more elevated than they are long. Mm -hmm. Definitely a trend they're going to want to try to buck. Yep. Nice uh, mark there by Amy Lugo. She's going to get the free kick in the center. Moves it in. And the Demons come out with it in their back 50. Tackle there, though. Loose ball. And the uh, Saints are trying to come away with it. See who they want and to. Let's see, uh, what, let's see how they're going to call it. Looks like they're going to ball it up. up. Now with it. Some bodies in the way now. Up, there's a kick towards goal. Oh, it right hit the, the goal post. It's going to be a behind. Bounce right off the top of the goal post. It looked like go it was going good, but the last second just came down. Bang, right on the top of the goal post. Eh, you don't win them all, but still he got it up and over. So that's. Yep. So it's now uh, 62. The score is 62 to 2 in favor of the Quebec Saints. And now uh, the Demons get the free kick out of their back 50. Nice mark there, center. Can't see who that is, can't see a number, but uh, kicks in. Oh, trying for the mark there on that was Matt Garofalo. Quebec's gonna come up with it, and then well, that's a tackle. And it's gonna be holding the ball. Free kick paid to the Demons. Going with the free kick now is Dave Morton. Helps when you get in those calls. So and he up. kicks it, uh, it's gonna go long, and we're gonna have, oh! Nice. Looks like we got a goal there. Let's see what the uh, goal Let's umpire see says. Give that to him. He's got it. It's first Boston's goal first for the Demons. The you know, like we said, you know, th that is their first goal, but I mean, they're definitely looking a lot stronger right now. They're not just letting, you know, Quebec roll right through them. Well, part, part of the key was in the first in the first quarter, they were really getting beat on their clearances from center. Mm -hmm. It doesn't seem to be that way now. That is really crucial, too, is you know, keeping it in the attacking end. Yeah, I mean, you, you see it all the time where if, if you can't get the ball out of a stoppage situation, you know, if you can't get the ball out of the ruck, it's really, you know, difficult to start making plays. But right there... Whoa! Finger on it. Handball yep. there uh, got uh, beaten, and here we go. Here comes uh, Quebec now. Goes to the dribble. Tried the bounce for a second there. Uh, let's see. Kicks Who's toward goal, going? and it looks like it's going to be a behind. Let's see. Nope. Went out. Uh, it's going to be a boundary throw in. Okay. Definitely, if Boston wants to keep it up, uh, they've definitely got to clear this one out, so yeah. we'll see who can get under it. And with it there, all the... Had someone there who had the had possession of the ball, but got tackled as soon as he got it. Mm -hmm. Now there's a battle for it, ball going along the ground. Too. Uh, and now with it, uh, there's a kick up. That's really high. Where's that one going? Looks like a behind there, and it is. is. That one kicked by number five. That's uh, Luke Anderson. Interesting bio on him. He's one of the uh, Australian expats that plays for the team. Birthplace, Geelong, Victoria, Australia. Home of my favorite AFL team. Yeah, fair number of expats on, the te on these teams. Yeah. Nice mark there by the Demons. They tried to play on, move it ahead, and they're trying to kick it up now to Garofalo. However, it, oh, they you can't take no the gets mark. hand on it, so it's going to... It was, uh, let's see, uh, Legas, uh, Legas trying to get his hands on it, but now here comes a Lego with it, trying to move it back now. Handball goes into space. Nobody's there, got it. Uh, nobody there got it, actually. Let's see. And let's see what we're going to call here. Are we like they're going to ball it up. Mm-hmm. And up we go again. And once again, uh, the Saints, it looks like they'll get the clearance. However, whoop, taken down there. They'll keep going to be holding the ball it, yep. against the Saints, which means that uh, you're going to have another free kick there for the Demons. Oh. Demons trying to uh, good climb their way there, yeah. back into this game. They've got good numbers right now by the... Uh, Oh, so we'll see what and let's see. That's going to go right towards the goal square, and uh, it's going to looks like it's going to go out on the. Nope, it's a behind. Oh, that was behind. Oh, good. That's a behind. Looks like it might have gone out on the full, but no, mm -hmm. it does uh, make it through the in the inside of the behind post. So it will be another point for the demons. So that's like you said. That's why we wait for their signal. Right. So here comes the kick. We'll have to see if they get a second goal. They're definitely rolling in the behinds right Free now. Kick but there. nice mark at center there. That's exactly how they put it in the textbooks. Yes. 
Now I think that's Morton once again who just kicked the goal. And uh, they're going to play on there. Kick for goal. It's long enough. And it's a behind, just missed. That's their fourth. So we've got what, one goal, four behinds mm -hmm. now. So it's now 63 to 10. 63 to 10, thank you. No worries. <laughs> I've got the score sheet, so it should be on me. <laughs> yeah. 63 to 10 now. Demons working on it uh, slowly but surely there. Mm -hmm. Once again, the free kick for the Saints out of their uh, back 50 because of the behind being scored. And now they try and kick it, uh, Quebec does. Winds up in Boston hands, though. They try and kick it back towards center. Nice Slides mark there. Forward. Nice mark there by Chris Lagasse, and then he gets taken down. Nice Boston the Demons, up with it. Demons are going to get the free kick. He's not wasting any time. And let's see, he's going, uh, trying to kick it. Uh, there's going to be a contest, and uh, no one comes away with the mark with that. Uh, battle for it now, and uh, still a battle for it in the uh, Boston forward 50. They're trying to get it out now. Legault tries to get it, taken away there by Sean Burbank. Burbank oh, tries to kick it over. On. Nice mark there by Ari Jonek. Great connection right there. Jonek there. He's going to try the kick for goal. Let's see if he's going to make Not. it. No. Nope. Oh. It's actually cut just underneath the goalposts. Might have had that one. Had but. the direction, just not the distance. And once again, it's Michael Shepard who takes away the goal from the football club that he's the president of. Nice mark there, giving a haverhook now, and the Saints start to move it back. Definitely Outside. good luck into that position. Kick out from out of their back pocket up uh, towards the 50 now. With the ball now is a number 18. That's Mick Lacey with the free kick. Giving his players some time to set up. Kicks it out into space. He's got a player standing by there. And he comes down with a mark. Nice mark there. And the kick. That's Looks like it's, uh, let's see. Look Looks like it's the... through for a goal. No signal from the ref yet. Unless he signaled while he was out there. Oh, he, yep, they asked him and he did signal, so that's a goal. Okay. That makes it first for this quarter, so. All right. After their explosion in the, in the first quarter. So now it's 69 to 10 in favor of the Quebec Saints. Heading up again is. And uh, trying to make the clearance is Boston now. And they come out, try and move it ahead. And uh, Quebec has it now, try a handball out of their back 50. It just uh, bounces back in the center the square. There. Uh, with it there, trying to get it there is uh, Rich Fuller. Can't do it. Uh, he's trying to hold up the uh, Quebec players now from moving it ahead. And with it no there, it's a luck. clear kick for goal. And that's a goal. Great opportunity there. <laughs> Excuse me. Plenty of daylight. So we'll move that one back to center and see if anything Boston has anything in response. 75-10 now in favor of the Saints. And they throw it up again in the center square. And it looks like the Saints will get the clearance again, trying to get it out to go. Can't oh, do it. Good bounce. Oh, a little bit of a hit there. That was a Sean Burbank. Mm -hmm. And uh, kick almost smothered it. Wound up, wound up smothering the kicker more than the kick itself. And uh, that's, a, that's a mark, but they're just going to play on, try and move it up the field. Inside the forward 50, trying to uh, counter for the so Demons there is Daniel one, Harris. Play. Oh, he does get a good smother, though. Yep. And they kick it. Oh, that's a behind. Or is it? That was a goal. Okay. Another goal now. And once again, the freight train named Quebec has started their roll. Mm-hmm. This is sort of shades of what we saw in the first quarter, you know. Just not getting a chance to counter. So I believe now it's 12-7, Quebec, still 1-4 for Boston. And once again, Quebec with the clearance, moves it, they move it into their forward 50. Barker he's with a kick a there. Oh, he's nailed it. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. No question on that one. I'm sorry it wasn't Barker, that was uh, Graham, number 53, not 35. Kyle Graham, 53 with the goal there. And now we've got 13 goals, 13-9 uh, now to 1-4. Here's some of the chatter, you know, trying to correct some of this stuff, you know. Obviously, communication is huge in every sport. About two minutes left to go in the second quarter. And once again, they'll ball it up from the center square. 
definitely would be nice if Bosca could get one going into the uh Oh, the break. Saints come out with the clearance again. Kick it to the forward 50. And, oh, can't take the right mark there. Hands. And uh, let's see there. The, actually, the preventive behind taken by the Demons. Mm -hmm. So now it's 13-10 uh, for the uh, Saints. Deciding to take that one as opposed to risking the goal. So. Right. Mark in the center there. Nice job there by Dave Morton. And he kicks it ahead. So you're going to have the distance. Oh, right no, the not able thing, to take so. the mark there was uh, number one, Rich Fuller. Taken away there, and with it now is uh, Lagasse, who Marching gets it up the field. over to Graham. Graham tries to kick it to the forward 50. Can't get the mark there, though. Battle for it now, coming out with it. Here are the Demons. Coming out with it there is Andrew Burns. Tries to kick it up ahead, and uh, it's not long. taken there. Yep. Well, once again, uh, Quebec trying to move it ahead. Lego can't take the mark, and now the Demons have it once again. He's in the right place for that one. Trying See, to kick up ahead. Gets it to connection. Fuller, who gets the mark and the free kick. And he's just going to play gonna on. He'll try and it. kick for goal. It's long enough. It's long enough. Question is, did it have the direction? Nope, looks like it's out on the full. Hmm. Which means that uh, the Saints will get a free kick. Shepard there will take the kick. He's been putting on a clinic today. Oh, yeah. And Shepard kicks out, going towards the middle there. No mark though. Nice spoil there by a num by number 23, kick. Bill Ward. I believe that's who that was. Mm -hmm. And now they uh, try and move it uh, once again. Demons trying to get it into their forward 50. It's taken out there and uh, kicked there. Oh. oh, almost had it there. That would have been a really nice mark there. Would have been a highlight if they had move. gotten it by uh, Graham. However. Um, the Saints do get a free kick, and that's going to be halftime. But he did get that one. Yes. At the end of two, we've got the Quebec Saints, 14 goals, 10 behinds, against one goal and four behinds for the Boston Demons. We'll be back with third quarter action next. You're watching Stateside Footy right here on WCTV. Because of them, 5 million people do not have polio. Because of them, families will not have to beg for a meal tonight. Because of them, thousands of high schoolers will never be known as dropouts. They are the 1.2 million members of Rotary, everyday people working together to push hope forward. Rotary, humanity in motion. Getting set, and they are going to ball it up, and we're set for second half action here. Once again, uh, the Demons are looking to make the quick clearance, and they go out, uh, kick goes outside along the boundary lines, uh, trying to pick it up there, but uh, not able to there. See who get, that gets rewarded to. Yeah. It's going to be a boundary throw in, I believe. Okay. Indeed, it is. Comes back out. Demons trying to keep it in their forward 50. However, it's knocked back. And they're going back for it right now. They're going to try and uh, kick it's it over. Try, on it. try and get through traffic. Uh, no one comes down with that. It's on the ground now. And uh, Quebec can't make a move with it. Here come the Demons again. A kick towards the forward 50. And a nice oh. mark there. That's a beautiful mark there. Right where you want it. Um, Good with a start. And it looks like he uh, just put that through. Definitely That's a goal there. The number half. 10, who is not on the uh, roster here, but if I'm looking by the uh, number roster here, it's Alistair McLean. Switch things up. No relation to the author who wrote Where Eagles Dare, I'm sure. Hmm. I don't know. That could be, If it is, it could make a good segment. Absolutely. And once again... Boston moving with it right now. Trying to get the clearance out of the center square. They kick now towards the forward 50. And it goes over everyone's head. Is that heading out? It's uh, still yeah, in and for the moment there. Looped back around. They're still playing bit. on. It's, around, it's rolling around the ground right now. And uh, they've still got it. Uh, trying to move it to hand pass over. Intercepted by Quebec. Kicked right through somebody's hands, though. And no uh, who's going to be that. the first one there? Looks like it's going to Demon tried to play it ahead. Mm -hmm. Winds up uh, going to the Saints now. He's all low. That's kick. not good. Oh, that's a mark right there. And he could have played on and gone for the goal, but instead he decides to stop, get the set shot, and kick the goal. I believe that was Graham with that there. He actually was behind everybody. He could have just uh, kept the uh, kept the uh, play going, but instead he decided to go for the uh, set shot and kick the goal. Yeah, well, you know, sometimes it's a risk you don't really want to take, you know, especially on the, with the lead they've got, might as well. Mm -hmm. Especially on a hot day like today. I don't know if I can keep the hustle up. Then again, I'm not an athlete like these guys. Mm -hmm. <coughs> oh. 
And once again, can Boston get away with it? Oh, right through oh. the legs. Saints coming with it again. And uh, it's a repeat long. of the first quarter. However, it looks like they missed. I think we got it behind there. So the Demons will get it for a free kick inside their little goal square. Did we get a signal? I wasn't quite. Yeah, no. It was, it, basically, if, he, if he's got the free kick from the goal square, it's a behind. All right. If it was a goal, they'd be balling it up at the center square. And kick up. Tried to take the mark there. That was uh, one of the Saints there trying to get that. It was Lacey. And uh, now moving is uh, Amy Legault. Tries to come up with it. And soccered ahead by one of the Demons. Picked up, though, by the Saints. Kicked through. Nice mark it's there by the Demons at center. It down one-handed. And kicked in the, just in front of the uh, player there. It's going to go out, looks like. Yep, mm -hmm. we're going to have a boundary throw in. That was a really nice pull down there. Mm-hmm. See everybody setting up pull in. Yep. And let's see. Uh, no clear con no, no clear control. Here we go now. And they try and get it out. Uh, no one there, though. Uh, handball ahead for the Demons. They try and get oh, it underneath. Whip. There we go. And the kick. Right and between. he kicks a little grubber right through the post. Gets a goal for that one. It doesn't have to be fancy. just has to work. Right. So now the Saints are at 16-10. And the Demons are at 3-4. and four. As my score sheet goes silly across the, the ground. I'm still holding on to mine, don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> so next game, we're going to stake things down. Yeah, I think so. And once again, they'll ball it up from the center square. Demons trying to work on getting the uh, clearance, and indeed it looks like they will. Oh! oh should have had the mark there. Just Absolutely should have had the mark. It's just a step further back where we needed yeah. to be. I believe all the players are changed here because now that was uh, that looked like uh, uh, Damian Hellum. Who uh, got that one? So I'm gonna have to get the copy of the roster that we didn't cross out all the players who weren't on the squad. <laughs> Not a lot of foresight. And the umpire calls play on, and the ball looks like it's gonna go out of bounds, and we're gonna have a boundary throw in. It's up, and and going forward now is a whole bunch of players there. Mm -hmm. Looks like a game of twister out there for a second, punched and uh, back. batted back, punched back there by the demons. However, they're unable to get it out of the uh, back 50 yet. Still moving forward, uh, yeah. Tackle there. Let's see. Did he... Uh, well, they're going to get uh, the free kick. The Demons are going to get a free, free mm -hmm. kick there. Was wondering when I heard the whistle whether it was going to be uh, holding the ball or a high tackle. Nice mark there, and here come the Demons. They're on the move. He kicks it as well. Kicks it, trying to get it up to the forward and 50, trying to get it to uh, Damien again. And a loose ball now. And it's going to get knocked out, mm -hmm. and they're going to get the behind for that. So now it's three goals, five for the Demons. 16 goals, 10 for Quebec. Mm -hmm. Quebec, they can afford, with the lead they've got, they can afford to play it safe like that. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely. And the kick goes out. Nice mark. That nice mark there. I believe that was Lacey. Yeah. Who came down with that one. Great agility on that one. Yep, trying to move out, uh, trying to get it uh, further to the forward 50. Tries to kick up, and it goes over everybody. However, Amy Legault has it now. She's going to make a She's kick for goal. And she, let's see. Yep, yep, she got it. She got the goal. It's kind of hard to uh, catch the ball and uh, do it all at, uh, one, all at the same time. We have 17-10 now for the Saints. 17-10 for the Saints against 3-5. Uh, for the Demons. And the Saints working on another clearance now. Trying to get it out of the center square. They can try to get out of the midfield area now. Moving ahead. Bit of a tackle there. Lost the ball. With it now, He's here comes Damien move. again. And he tries to move it up. And the Demons have it now. And oh, Not they can't get the kick. Back. They can't get the kick away. They were going to try a kick for goal, but they get held back at the last minute. It influenced the kick, and now. Saints just soccer it ahead, trying to get it there. That's right over Graham. his head. And now with it, with the kick there, trying to get the, oh, kicked it right over Haverhoek's head. And it's going to bounce. Heading? And it's going to go through for a goal. Uh, that was a pool shot. Sometimes they just come together for you. Ava Mataya could not do any better than that. 
Started out as just a kick toward the forward 50. No one was able to put a hand on it. It just continued, turned, uh, turned into a grubber, made it right through the goalposts. And so now, Quebec at 18-10. 18 goals, 10 behinds. Against Boston, three goals, five behinds. And don't worry about the computation because the graphics on the screen will take care of it. Mm -hmm. That's uh, all it counts. See. Over there, and nice job there. Graham's got it now off the handball. He kicks it over, and Amy Lugo can't come up with it. The Demons come up with it, though. Winding up with it there is uh, Jason DeGeorge, it looks like, number 36. Punches it right into the middle. And kick back towards the Saints' hand. Oh, oh. Lugo can't make the mark again. Can't she tries to kick it from an odd angle, and it's going to go in for a behind. behind on that one. Just behind the goal post. Snuck it in, but... Yep, so now Quebec is at 18-11 versus uh, Boston, three goals, five. As I got my unmar my unedited copy of the Demons roster there in here. There we go. <laughs> All right. So the Demons now. Set up for the kick. The free kick. Although... From, from where that kick was taken, though, you got to double check that, see if that was behind or if it went out on the full. Because if it was a behind. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That actually, that last one was not a behind. That one was a kick out on the full, which is why Boston kicked it from there. Once again, the angle we're at, it's kind of hard to, sometimes to judge the goalpost, the angle. But uh, now the uh, play comes back through. Trying to get it pick off there, and uh, he can't, uh, can't get his hands on it. That was uh, Damian Hellum. Tried to soccer it ahead and then pick it up. That one might have been going into the wind a little bit. Right. And now going for it is Helm again. It's one of the uh, players we had a nice opportunity to chat with before the game. And uh, Quebec almost had the mark there. Now there's a battle for it along the ground. And Quebec trying to get it out of their back 50. Handball ahead. Going now to Graham. Graham kicks it. And they've got someone right below. And oh, he oh. can't take the mark. He was right there in front of the goal. And he kicks it along the ground and gets the goal anyway. He tried to get it to P.J. Devine. Devine couldn't come up with the catch, but he was able to soccer it through the goalpost. Still great hustle. He stayed on it. Yeah, now Quebec is at 19-10. Uh, and once again, they'll ball it up in the center square. Mm -hmm. About five minutes left to go in the third quarter of this uh, Metro footy game today. You're watching Stateside Footy on WCTV alongside Kyle Serena. I'm Bill Robert. We're watching the uh, reserves from the Boston Demons playing the Quebec Saints. Quebec right now off to a monstrous lead. Pretty much have dominated since the opening throw up. They're enjoying Ipswich Park as much as I am. Yeah, exactly. And so uh, the goal has it now. Oh, it's taken down there. That's a rough take down there. But the Saints still have it. Trying to kick it and put it ahead there as Lacey tried to handball it. Now just tries to kick it toward goal. And it goes over the head of Devine and it's going to go out for a behind. So now it's 19 11. Sometimes you got to let the bounce do the work for you. Indeed. And the kick comes out of the goal square. And, oh, can't take the mark there. Who was that? Uh, they're still playing on here. Mm -hmm. Another kick Saints there. On the move, but if he... oh, and the mark, mark taken by the Demons inside their back 50. Hits him square in the chest. And now they're going to come out with it. Uh, kick towards uh, midfield. Nice mark there. He uses height on that one. Taken there. That's a very, very nice job there. Luke Anderson with that one. And now it goes in the uh, Quebec forward 50. Another kick for goal. And uh, just missed it. Got it behind there. Still a good kick, though. Oh, yeah, absolutely. So now it's 19-12 in favor of the Quebec Saints, 19-12 to 3-5. Mm -hmm. Qu Quebec holds on to that one. Remind me next time, get, get a kid with a calculator on the crew here. <laughs> Let's see, and it bounces weird, but it's going to go for a behind. The perils of having an English major as your uh, color man. <laughs> well, it's one of those things is just, uh, by the time you calculate the score, there's already been a whole bunch more done. Mm -hmm. uh, and the Demons now have it, uh, and then they kick it, uh, trying to get it up midfield. However, the Saints have main, um, regained possession of it now. And they kick to their forward 50. It's rolling, and it's rolling, and it's it? going to... Uh, Let's see. It's going to stop just short. Oh, runs out of steam right just at the line. Just short. And uh, they're going to hold it up right there. Yep. Yeah. Ball up right right outside goal. 
obviously this one's pretty critical. And this is one of those occasions where you might, even if you're Boston, you might want to punch it through. But no, they're going to try and move it ahead. Can't do it, though. Um, Devine tried to move with it, but they had it taken away. And now with it, here's Barker. Barker, oh, nice nice smother there. Nice job smothering the kick by moving, Dave Morton. But... Oh. A nice mark, though. They tried to, yeah. Demons tried to kick it out, but it was picked off. Nice job there. Luke Anderson with the mark and the free another kick from midfield. Moves it ahead now. And they're moving it. Another mark, mm -hmm. another free kick. And rather than playing on, they'll just take the free kick. Mm -hmm. Stop Give it and go. See if they kick their goal from here. And it's high. It's there. And it's a goal. 20th goal for the Saints. And now they lead 133 to 23. But like you said, this is the reserves, and they're def they're definitely not you know getting rolled through the same way they were in the first quarter. Mm -hmm. They're yeah. definitely putting up a great fight. Yeah, and then they have managed to get some clearances and, and move with the ball in their forward 50. But yeah, still, you know, it's been mostly Saints ever since mm -hmm. the game started. Guess the long trip uh, didn't quite wear them down as hope much as Boston. Morton hoped. coming into the ruck for the Demons. And uh, now a battle along the ground for it. Still along the ground. They're trying to uh, get possession somewhere. And Quebec coming out with it now. Try a kick to the forward 50. And uh, nobody's got it, but open there. Devine has it. Ha oh, tried to handball it over to Amy Legault, who's able to kick it through and dribble it through for a goal. Another grubber for six, and now it's 139 to 23. Quebec, 21 goals, 13 behinds. 139 points been a great showing I mean you know just a lot of the plays have just been really sharp and they've been showing great speed too oh absolutely mm -hmm. Let's see what comes of this all right now it's with it is uh, Graham Graham tries to kick it over once again to the forward 50 and a nice spoil there by the demons and still uh, battling uh, the umpire is still saying play on the ball is still on the ground yep it's on the, it's on and the with move. it now, there's Haverhoek. Haverhoek with a kick, and it looks like he's got the goal. Off angle, it's one of those you don't have time to set it up. Just uh, drop it and fly, let it fly. And that's exactly what they did, and they got the goal with it. They're staying on the attack, which is something their coach is probably proud about. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Well, uh, looking at the website, uh, Quebec is uh, one of the better teams in the competition. And that's uh, three-quarter time now, the score. The Quebec Saints, 22 goals, 13 behinds, 145 points. And the Boston Demons, 3 goals, 5 behinds, 23 points. We'll be back with fourth quarter action next. You're watching Stateside Footy right here on Wilmington Community Television. child from foster care. Just being there makes all the difference. Getting set to start the final quarter of action here at Ipswich River Park. It's a Metro footy with the Boston Demons and the Quebec Saints as they get set to uh, ball it up in the center square for, to start the final quarter of play. Mm -hmm. And here we go. And uh, the Demons trying to work it out first. And they do indeed try and kick it ahead to their forward 50. However, Gets it's uh, hand on it. handed away there by a Saint and uh, a kick there, tried to uh, get it off the ground there, power. and it went out on the full, which means that uh, Quebec's going to get a free kick from uh, just outside the boundary line. It was one of those where uh, you'll see those every once in a while where the ball would just be running on the, on the ground rather than like, try and pick it up and do something with it. They'll just try a random kick for goal, try and kick it off the ground as it rolls. In that case, it didn't work out very well for them as it wound up being uh, out on the full, and therefore the Saints get the free kick from... Uh, just outside the boundary line in the left back pocket. And Shepard will put it up towards midfield. And a nice spoil there. It's going to go out of bounds. Coming over the top there. I believe that was uh, Chris Lowe, number 21. Or is it 22? Well, we'll get a good angle on the uh, yeah. boundary throw in right here. Oh, absolutely. Get a great angle on it. 
Score stands right now, Quebec 22 goals, 13 behinds, 145 points. And Boston, three goals, five behinds, 23 points. And the Saints get it again and uh, look to have a good clearance right there. Hand pass over to Lacey. Lacey kicks it to the forward, 50. Oh, Nice mark there by the Demons. And they're going to kick it and Save try and it. get it uh, out of their back 50 now. With the ball now is uh, Nick Fantoni, number six. I'm sorry, that actually has changed. That's Tom. That's uh, the Phantom Tom, the uh, guy who just joined the club. Hand pass now. Uh, the Quebec Saints have it again. And the kick goes through, and that's a goal. Goal for the Saints there. So it's now 23-13, 151 for the Saints. Saints leading 151-23. to About two minutes into the final quarter of play of this Metro footy match here at Ipswich River Park. Home field advantage not really panning out for Boston. <laughs> Well, no, unless you happen to be Shepard or Divine. Touche. Yeah. Here we go. Once again, the uh, ball up in the center square. Knocked over once again, and uh, just soccered ahead by it, the yeah. Saints. Tries and to hold them up. Uh, Handballed ahead, but uh, winds up going on the ground. And they get it over. The goal has oh. it now. It's not only smothered, but caught. Nice job there by the Demons. He'll Coming back on D that. in the back 50. And uh, now uh, moving ahead with it. Here comes Boston. He's Scoops held up, it. though. I think it was because of the hold he's getting it. Yep, mm -hmm. because of the holding, yep. He dropped the ball. So now the uh, free kick being given, that's Morton there. And he kicks it into the forward 50. Trying to go up for it there. Oh, uh, a little bit hands. of a marking contest. Kicking it there, going through. And, oh, Ooh. just missing. Just missing for a behind. That was uh, number 10, Al McLean. So it's now 151 to 24. Still good play there. That was great oh, yeah. the way they just marched on the field mm -hmm. like that. Having that free kick help, too. Mm -hmm. His hands just And here comes Shepard now to kick it out. And a nice mark there at midfield. Yeah, he pushed him away. He had plenty of space. I believe that was Haverhoek who had that. It's going to bounce off the ground here. They're still going to get it, though. And uh, the Demons wind up picking it up. Oh, hang on. I think uh, PJ, yeah, PJ's going to get the free kick. Demons called for holding the ball. So PJ Devine will get the free kick for the Saints. Mm -hmm. And he kicks it into the forward 50. Nice spoil there by the Demons, and they're going to try and move out with it now. They just kick it ahead off the ground. And who's going to be the first player there? Uh, a couple of players meet at the same time. They're just it's sliding around, but he was yep. waiting for that one. This ball's still on the ground. And now the Saints trying to move it. Kick and they'll kick it to the forward to 50. Haverhoek just handballs it ahead. Tries to get it and gets it up now to Lacey. Lacey tries to kick it across. A little too long for him. However, they've got it now. And the kick goes through. That's going to be a goal. So it's 157 now. 24-13, 157 for the Saints. Still 24 for the Boston Demons. Uh, you know, we're, we're seeing plenty of people, so the reserves are definitely getting their uh, mm -hmm. the, t the money's worth out of this. Oh, absolutely. Yeah. They're actually, every once in a while, they're, they're swapping uh, players in and out. Looks like for a while the uh, the Demons bench was the entire interchange bench there. The Demons are moving it ahead now, trying to get it up. Uh, oh, it just goes over the out right, out right, outstretched hand there of uh, McLean. And uh, brings him around. Yep. And kicking it out now is uh, Graham. Just going to dribble through midfield. And. Battle along the ground for it right now. It's still on the ground. A tangle. Still a battle. And they're going to uh, ball it up, it looks like. Mm -hmm. Which is indeed what they'll be doing. Just under 10 minutes left to go in the final quarter of action here. And the uh, ruck is taken right to uh, Quebec, who gets it up into the forward 50. But then Quebec picks it up there. And with it right now is uh, Damian Hellam. He's got it again now. He kicks it ahead, looking for somebody oh, in midfield. Great and a nice mark. Found somebody in space there, wide open. And now he tries to kick it towards the forward 50. Bounces oh. over Shepard. Oh, it takes a short bounce, though. And he's got it right in front. And he's going to hit the goal post. Oh, man. He had it right in front in the goal square. Went to kick what should have been a sure goal, and he clanged it right off one of the goal posts. So that's going to be a behind as opposed to a goal. That was a strong showing, though, that... Now instead of being 157 to 30, it's 157 to 25. 
that's right in front. I mean, the only thing missing there was the, the bow and the gold gift wrapping. Yeah. And it just kicked it right off the goalpost. Not going to be happy with that, but... And that uh, trying to get the mark there was um, Lagos for the Saints. However, that was spoiled. Nice job there by the Demons on defense. And now they kick it ahead. And it bounces uh, to Helm now. He's got it. He's uh, going to try and kick it across. And trying to get it there is McLean. Quite center, yeah. Winds up in Quebec Hanzo, and they're going to try and kick it out from the back pocket. Goes right past the Demon, winds up going onto the hands of P.J. Devine. Mm -hmm. Off the bounce. Yeah, who's uh, taken down. He was in the grass. Speaking but I think of bouncing. They're gonna, yeah, they're going to call him for holding the ball there. The, the Demons are going to get the free kick on that one. And uh, they kick it ahead. Let's see who's got it here. Looks like they've got uh, oh, Damian Hellam, however. He had he a hand on it. Uh, yeah. Had a hand on it, but couldn't pull down the mark. And loose ball now in the center of the field. With it there now is Lacey. He's doing the bounce there off the ground and try, almost hand it ahead, but uh, wound up uh, choosing not to do so, trying to get it up yeah, to Shepard. Shepard's got it now. Shepard with a kick toward goal. And let's see. I think they missed that one. Yep. Went behind the goal post. Okay. So that uh, wound up uh, resulting in no points for Quebec. So now to kick it out of his own back pocket, Matt Garofalo. Who's he going to try to connect with? Somebody in midfield. Just over oh. his head, though. And uh, there first looks like it's going to be uh, Graham. Graham has it now. Graham bounces it. Kicks it ahead. Denied him there. Yep. I think he was trying to get the mark, though. Mm. And that goes under, and I think we have a behind there. The one thing is earlier on, we were waiting for the calls from the, uh, the uh, goal umpires. But half the time now, the goal umpires just make a really quick signal, then run and <laughs> shag the ball. But it's a, it's a free kick from the uh, center square, so uh, the uh, goal square, rather. So it is indeed a behind. Nice mark there at midfield there by Andrew Burns. A to B, that's all you need. Yep, A, B, Andrew Burns, you got it. Goes I didn't over even think of that. head here, though. Subliminal, nice. There you go. And Quebec will wind up with it first. Shepard has it now. Shepard tries to kick it up ahead. And the mark taken there, nice job there by Garofalo. And he's going to kick it, try and get it inside to McLean. Can't do it. And uh, let's see what we uh, have here. Hmm. Looks oh. like the uh, kick's going to be against the Demons. Mm -hmm. I mean, for the Demons, I should say. Went for clean through, though, on the bounce of the cell. He had plenty of power on it. By the way, that, uh, that behind makes it 158 to 25 now in favor of the Saints. McLean with the uh, free kick now. Last kick for goal. He pretty much was in kissing distance of the goal. And clanged one right off the goal post. See if he can make up for Let's it see here. see what he does from here. Kicks it up, and it goes up, and... And it looks like we've got the goal there. Fourth goal of the day for the Demons. Not, not the best news that a side can hear, but I mean... <laughs> I got one free quarter. Although, one, once again, uh, you know, the, uh, the, the strings of irony are playing in the background. A nice one there from uh, just inside the 50 line that he kicked in before. He was right in the goal square. And put, you know, just hit one right off the stick. And now the uh, uh, coming out of the ruck, it's uh, cleanly taken by Quebec. Nice uh, handball there uh, back and forth between uh, Lagasse. And we've got uh, stoppage in play there. A couple of players a little slow to get up. But they're going to ball it up. Yeah. No, actually a free kick. I'm sorry. Free kick's been paid to the Demons. And the kick goes over, and oh, oh almost a mark went over, him. went over McLean's head. They almost had a clean mark for uh, Quebec, but uh, not quite. I think that was Barker who almost came down with that one for the Saints. And now uh, the handball goes out to Lagasse. Back, oh, they tried to handball it back to Shepard. Couldn't do it. The D's take it now. The D's trying to move with it. He's looking for something. Kicking there Finds in it. space. And now they try and kick it to the uh, forward 50. McLean trying to settle under it, and he's going to take it. He's yeah, and he kicks it just off the ground, gets the goal. Couldn't quite make the mark, but he makes the best of the opportunity. Well, he doesn't need the mark. The important thing was he kicked the goal. Mm -hmm. 36 points now for the Demons. Nice job there by McLean. Rather than uh, trying to uh, do it the fancy way, pick it up and drop kick it. It's rolling on the ground. Just have at it. Just take just take a swipe at it. Indeed, he got it right through the goal posts. And they're still playing a great game. It's you know They're, they're out here to have fun as well yeah. as you know compete, so they're not checked out like you might yeah. have seen it. Right, they, 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 yeah, they haven't mentally checked out of it. They're still fighting. They're still battling yeah. there. And it uh, looks like they're going to get the clearance here, too. And the ball goes up now to uh, Burns. And uh, 
There we go. No Keeps whistle so far. Move. Everything's still going. Yeah, I was expecting one for a little bit there. Yeah, almost looked like uh, there was a stoppage or maybe even a holding the ball. And now we have it, and they're going to kick it into the uh, right on goal, and it's a behind. Still, he got really good contact with that ball. Yeah, they had had an opportunity to do it, but uh, just couldn't uh, connect with it there. So now 37. 37 points now for the Demons against 158 for the Quebec Saints. And the Saints now will kick it out of the uh, goal square in their back 50. And the kick goes out to Shepard. Shepard takes the mark easily. He'll get the free kick. Shepard now looking, trying to kick it, trying to move it over. Oh, it goes right over somebody's head. Nice mark there, picked up there by Graham. And now Graham's going to kick it ahead. Another nice mark taken by Lacey. He's going to make a kick for goal here. And let's see. You know, it's actually not going to make it. Mm -hmm. Stopped short there by one of the Demons who kicks it out to midfield. No real recipient in mind. They just wanted to get the ball out of there. As a result, Quebec takes over, and they are moving the ball once again. Taken there. Nice job there by Garofalo. And uh, moves up now. And who's going to get it there? Oh, uh, nice kick. Then nice found mark there taken by the Saints. And they're going to kick it right back into space. They've got somebody open just over their head, though. And the ball's going to go along the ground where it's going to be picked up here by Haverhoek. Haverhoek makes enough. a kick toward goal. And that's a goal for sure. Just made it, but this 25. That's so that's uh, 164 now. 164 for 37, the score, the score here. Quebec 164, Boston 37. Dipped into the Australian accent there for a second. I Just that. a bit, mate. Just a bit. Yeah, like we mentioned before, there actually are a fair number of expats on these teams. So it's, oh, a, it's actually a really nice blend of the mm -hmm. of, you know people from the area. A nice thing, too, is the uh, the Aussies really appreciate you know people taking the interest in the game here. And the kick, it looks like that one went behind. So, uh, once again, Quebec scoring. That one had plenty of life to it and kept moving, so... Yep. So it's 165 now. And the kick out. Moves through midfield now. With it, here comes Joe Connor. Connor tries to kick it to the forward 50. Get in front of trying it. to get it to McLean. Winds no. up uh, rolling out of bounds, and there'll be a boundary throw in. Demons will try and get the advantage in their forward 50. Let's see who can get This is probably one of the last opportunities Boston will have as the time's yeah. taken away. Yeah, really. We've only got a couple minutes left in the quarter here, in fact, in the game. And it's uh, knocked out of the zone. Getting their first nice uh, bit of effort there. Oh, PF Flyers the on. Yeah. <laughs> and let's see. Oh, nice spoil there. Comes out Looked of like they had it going it on to Adam Shippers, but it was spoiled by Haverhoek. He punched it away at the last minute there. And now Legault has it inside the forward 50. She's going to make a kick for goal. And uh, we hear applause, which is usually the universal sign of a goal. Or if you're happy and you know it. <laughs> that too. Yes, thank you. And I believe they're setting up for the uh, ball up at uh, center square. So they indeed, come back it looks like middle. it was the case. So now it's 26-14. 20, so it's, uh, I don't know, I've lost track at this point. Needless to say, the Quebec Saints are in the lead here. Mm -hmm. With about 15 seconds left to go. So Yeah, so we'll probably just get about up in the air. Right? Yeah, you know, at this point, possession's academic. But they will ball it up. And the Saints get it out of the ruck now. Story of the day. And there we go. That's the end of the game. Mm -hmm. That's, That's all she wrote. Still great showings by both teams. Yeah. I mean, this doesn't see you can't see it on the score sheet, but I mean they both were nice and physical. Mm -hmm. The final score stands. The Quebec Saints, 25 goals, 13 behinds, 164 points, defeating the Boston Demons reserves. Their score, five goals, seven behinds, 37 points. 164 to 37, the final score. Quebec coming away victorious, and that's going to do it for this edition of Stateside Footy. Thanks, Kyle Serino. Glad also to, have. to our volunteer camera people, Don Laird and Stephen Valenti. And thanks to everyone for joining us today, too. You've been watching Stateside Footy, brought to you by the volunteers of Wilmington Community Television. Have a great day.